Uh, coming to uh, the uh, the uh, musical festivals that you conduct, uh, you have been continuing the tradition of uh, uh, Navaratri Mantapa Utsavas and also um, the Swati Sangeet Utsavas. Yes. Uh, and also uh, many times you have actually uh, uh, kind of broken some traditions and uh, allowed many people to sing and uh, many you have brought in new concepts. Uh, yeah. So can you please uh, talk uh, about that? One, uh, when I was a young person, uh, we had only male Hmm. Vocal concerts with violin and madangam. Uh, that's it. No upavukavadiam, hmm. no female, no veena, uh, then veena solo, hmm. uh, no violin solo, no flute solo, no go to adhyam. Only male vocal and veena. Hmm. That is all. So, um, uh, over the years, it is not a sudden thing. So, I started asking how come women are not allowed to sing in a Navaratri festival for Goddess Saraswati. Yeah. <laughs> Conducted by a family where the women uh, have all the money and the power. There is a matrilineal, yeah. matriarchal family yeah. uh, conducting a festival for Saraswati where women are not allowed. I could never understand. Mm -hmm. So I kept, kept, kept questioning this and slowly, slowly started making uh, some changes. I discovered that uh, one of the greatest patrons of art, my great grandmother, Amma Maharani, mm -hmm. she liked one particular Veena player a lot. Okay. And she wanted him to perform at Navaratri Mandapa. At that time, there was no Veena. Hmm. So, because she wanted him to perform, she said, See, Veena is Saraswati Devi's instrument. So, we can play. Just to get him to play. Okay. Then, instead of uh, just that one man playing, she called some more Veena players. <laughs> like that. that is how the change happened hmm. first. Okay. And Amma Maharani was a visionary. Hmm. I have taken a lot uh, from her. Hmm. What she did was that, if you look at some of the greatest names of Carnatic music in the 20th century, mm -hmm. uh, G.N. Bala Subramaniam, or Shamangur Srinivasayar, or Musri Subramaniyar, or mm -hmm. M.D. Ramanathan, or Alatur Brothers, or K.V. Narayana Swami, yeah. or Pudukot Krishnamurthy. Yeah. All these people, Amma Maharani called them when they were teenagers. Okay. Uh, and uh, while in T.N. Krishnan, she started calling him in Navaratri Mandapam when he was nine years old. Oh, wow. As a nine year old boy, fourth standard, He's studying in fourth standard and he's playing at the Navaratri Mandapa. Hmm. And he became Padma Vibhushan, Sangeeta Kalahati, Professor, whatever, later. Yeah. Samangani became Dr. Samangani, Sangeeta Kalahati, Padma Vibhushan. So, so many of them were decorated with Sangeeta Kalahati, Padma Awards and 100 other titles and they are like the legends hmm. now. Right. But when she called them, they were 16 year old, 9 year old and 15 year old. So, she had the vision to invest in the future. Right. Which unfortunately, very, very few people seem to have. Now, mm -hmm. so people call somebody who's already been, uh, and some many people who are past their time also. Mm -hmm. So past their time has nothing to do with age. Mm -hmm. Ms. Subalakshmi, till she sang, she sang well. Though she was, I think, 80 or whatever, her voice, everything was exactly in place. Yeah. When, she, when you listen to her last recording, you won't feel, ah, she's an old woman. She sounds like Ms. Subalakshmi. She was mm -hmm. full. Uh, here in Bangalore, R.K. Srikantan was there. Hmm. He was 90 or something. Yeah. He, he, there's nothing wrong with his voice hmm. uh, or singing till he was, uh, till he sang, right. uh, whatever age. So like that, there are so many people, Pudukot Krishnamurti, my guru, Balamur Likshra, my guru, Vachyur Hari Subramanaya, hmm. M.D. Ramnathan, they all maintained their equipment very well until the end. Hmm. So uh, while some people, because they sang nicely in 1960 or 70, now they are singing like this, but even then because of some nostalgia or whatever, they are called again and again and they can't really sing. Mm -hmm. uh, that is little sad. Yeah. While uh, Amma Maharani, she called those people and those people, they are happy that oh she, she is one lady, she has been calling us from the time we are 15 years old. So even when they are 60 years old and they are decorated musicians, they still remember that and mm -hmm. who have goodwill towards the family. They okay. sing Swatirnal Kritis in their other concerts also. Mm -hmm. So that vision to invest in the future, even I was talking to somebody recently, even in our athletics for example, mm -hmm. Olympics comes, one guy shoots or one guy does badminton and wins a gold medal, then they are given 25 lakhs, 3 crores, 10 crores and whatever. Yeah. But in India we have millions of people, so take somebody and train them and create future champions and invest money in creating a champion, that happens very rarely, yeah. unfortunately. So in music also, when we really need, at that time when they are young and they are hungry for concerts and improvement and whatever, then we should uh, give them the right input and right encouragement and okay. whatever. That I believe in very, very strongly. Yeah. Uh, I have seen both, uh, where encouragement 
is not given and mm-hmm. uh, people are suppressed oppressed that i have seen and i have seen people nurturing uh, the younger generation very nice both i have seen mm-hmm. so i really really cherish okay. the values that amma maharani stood for and i try and bring new people okay. into the fold uh, i had a uh, veena concerts mm-hmm. violin which were happening already violin solo okay. flute solo gotu vadyam solo okay then only in 2007 that is so recent Uh, the women were allowed inside the navaratri mandapam okay. not only to perform even to listen so oh, all okay. those concerts of samangudi md ramnathan alathuru pradesh uh, pudukod krishnamurthy women could only hear the voice they can't see they are sitting there and listening oh my god so okay. so sad no yeah, yeah. and uh, a person like md ramnathan there's a lot to see so, so many things are happening there yeah. there is a fascinating visual so, so they missed all that which is hmm. very sad okay no? okay so but at least now uh, it is happening Okay. So that is Navaratri, but Navaratri only Hindus are allowed. Hmm. Men have to take off their shirt. Okay. Uh, women have to dress in Kerala temple attire. Hmm. No churidar. Only okay. sari or sari. skirt. Okay. There is no applause. You have to come by six. You have to sit till eight thirty like that. So then there is other festival, Swati Sangeet Utsav. Hmm. That is kind of more like my baby. Navaratri is something which has been going on for years and years. Okay. Where I could make some changes, but Swati Sangeet Utsav, whatever. is restrictive in navaratri i remove that in chaitrinal festival hmm. so swati sangeet also uh, westerners come wearing shorts also for example hmm. anybody can take video or photo there is applause and it's a free atmosphere okay so people can talk explain the meaning of the song there is applause and some people whistle also okay okay <laughs> so like that that happened for 23 years okay until the pandemic came okay the pandemic came and it destroyed a lot of things financially and yeah. uh, socially and so many things So after 2020, I have not had that festival till now. Okay, okay, all right. So what is your uh, vision in the sense? Are there any more changes required, uh, or uh, do you see the uh, these uh, festivals being done in a different way in the in the future? Maybe I don't know. I mean, so many concerts happened online during the pandemic. Mm-hmm. For example, I mm-hmm. find generally uh, the classical arts in general, mm-hmm. except for the few people who are right on top. Mm-hmm. or people who have something to do with films or they are celebrity in some other way their instagram followers are 3 million or whatever yeah. so that kind of people they are paid nicely mm-hmm. but the normal standard good musician the payment is very bad mm-hmm. in uh, generally yeah. yeah there are some very few places where they treat us nicely mm-hmm. the average payment for carnatic music is pathetic so in my case uh, i have changed the payment module in navaratri mandapam a lot Okay. A lot, lot, lot. I said I don't give millions or anything, but from what it used to be mm-hmm. when I first started getting involved, then my family used to say, "Oh, you are so greedy for money." So I till today I have not taken one rupee from the Navaratri Trust. Okay. So, but I ask for this kind of payment. Mm-hmm. So what I get, I put as Kanika next day in the temple. Okay. So I, they know that I have not taken one rupee, but I feel it deserves. to be paid this was not for me hmm. so the people who come also they have prepared uh, special swatrinal songs and navratri krutis means the first day they have to sing devi jagajani in sankara param so many restrictions are there hmm. so after the concert is nice they should be given really nice food and uh, really good payment also so they should feel hmm. i just uh, the trip was nice and they should think yeah. back and have one warm happy feeling Correct. and they should feel oh i hope i'll be called again No, not like oh, you once was enough. Thank you. No, there are places where we go, we feel never again. Hmm. No, we don't want to even to see their faces of the or hear their some phone numbers. We won't even answer. No, <laughs> because they'll be yeah. so cheap and uh, they just want to get something free of cost. Uh, exploit people and uh, to talk sweetly. Or, no? Yeah. So that uh, I've changed a lot. Okay. Uh, okay. So okay. then I request the musicians. See, everybody sings. సార సాక్ష పరిపాలే కృపయ పాలే శవరి భోగీంద్ర సాయన సారమైన మాటలు ఎంతో విశ్వేశ్వర దర్శనకర్ ధనాశ్రీ తిల్లానా దేవదేవ కళ్యాణ రైట్ సో అపార్ట్ ఫ్రమ్ దీస్ ట్వంటీ సాంగ్స్ ట్రై అండ్ సింగ్ సంథింగ్ ఎల్స్ ఓకే సో ది యంగ పీపుల్ హూ మై కాల్ మెనీ ఆఫ్ దెమ్ ఆర్ దే అండర్స్టాండ్ వై అండ్ దే టేక్ దట్ ఎఫర్ట్ టు బ్రింగ్ ఫ్రెష్ కాంపోజిషన్స్ అరౌండ్ త్రీ హండ్రెడ్ ఆర్ దేర్ మహారాజా సో యా అట్లీస్ట్ సమ్ మోర్ షుడ్ బి బ్రాట్ అవుట్ ఎవ్రీ ఇయర్ ఓకే Uh, and uh, uh, talking about the uh, 
uh, the Vagayakaras of uh, Kerala and especially in Malayalam language. Uh, we don't get to hear much in Karnataka actually. Yeah. Uh, so, so I think uh, you have tried to actually uh, sing many uh, different songs from many different composers. Yeah. So, okay. can you talk a little ab uh, bit about Kerala composers? Kerala composers is different, Malayalam is different. <coughs> <laughs> so, okay. see, Kerala composer, living composer, uh, Dr. T. V. Gopalakrishnan is there. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I, I don't think he's composed even one song in Malayalam. Okay. Well, he composed many songs in Tamil hmm. uh, and uh, some in Sanskritam also. Yeah. So, Sanskritam, Malayalam, Swadhitrinal Maharaja, he has composed some padams in what they call Manipravalam, which is Malayalam and Sanskritam mix. Okay. Where it is heavily Sanskritized, hmm, hmm. Uh, but not pure Malayalam. Okay. Uh, then we have had M. D. Ramanathan, hmm. who, who was a Vagayakara. Hmm. who is composed maximum in Telugu hmm. uh, and Sanskritam and then Tamil. Okay. So even his uh, Sanskritam songs he's written in Telugu script hmm. though he's a Malayali. Hmm. But Malayalam songs I've seen one or two in his books. Hmm. That's all. So Malayali composers composing in Malayalam like I the first when we opened the interview I sang Karuna Seva Nandu Tamasa. Yeah. and Tampi who is Swatirnal's uh, guru. Hmm. Uh, there, there are uh, Kutti Kunja Tangachi his uh, niece or sister somebody like that. Yeah. There, there are Composers from Kerala who have composed in Malayalam, hmm. but uh, apart from a few people who are trying to uh, do something for them, which is a wonderful thing, hmm. in the general repertoire, uh, it, Malayalam songs have not come that yeah. much. And the songs which have come also, this heavy influence of Sanskritam hmm. uh, than Malayalam. I think it is the same state in Karnataka also. Like many of the Karnataka composers actually, uh, they composed in different languages. Uh, Mysuru was there. Yeah, yeah, exactly. He yeah. is composed in Kannada? I, uh, no, no. Uh, maybe one or two songs. Yeah. But, uh, I have heard mostly many. Sanskritam Telugu. Yeah, yeah. Right. I have heard his talking in Kannada. Yeah, yeah. But uh, so when I think of Mysuru was there, I don't know. Exactly. Some beautiful. Uh, uh, yeah. Sanskritam songs all, are also there. Pahi Krishna Vasudeva Dehi Satgatim Madhava Mysore Vasir. So right. beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I think, uh, I mean, at least uh, in Kannada we have from uh, Purandara Dasa and from Dasa Parampara we have a lot of uh, songs. How many? But the uh, new composers, uh, I think, chose to uh, compose in a different language than uh, Kannada yeah. itself. Uh, uh, can you uh, tell us a little bit about the Utsava Prabandhas? Uh, so, Adhitrinal Maharaja, uh, Travancore capital was a place called Patmanabhapuram, hmm. which is near Kanyakumari, okay. uh, which is now in Tamil Nadu, when the linguistic division of states happened. Hmm. So, uh, but Padmanabha Swami temple is in Tiruvanathapuram, hmm. and uh, slowly the capital of Travancore started getting shifted from Padmanavaram to Tiruvanthapuram. Mm -hmm. And Maharaja Swarathirinav was obsessed with Padmanava Swami. Mm -hmm. So he was the uh, Maharaja who fine, did the final step of shifting to Tiruvanthapuram. Mm -hmm. Then he only codified the Navaratri celebrations by composing nine Navaratri Kritis, okay. uh, which are sung even now, yeah. on the nine days of Navaratri. Same way he codified the Utsavam, the mm -hmm. festival in the Padmanabha Swami temple, which okay. happens once in six months, mm -hmm. once in uh, March, April, and once in uh, October, November. Okay. Then the deities, uh, Sri Padmanabha, Lord Narasimha, and Sri Krishna, three mm -hmm. deities are brought out in vahanams, carried okay. by people. Okay. So each day is a different vahanam, uh, Simhasana vahanam, Ananta vahanam, mm -hmm. then Kamala vahanam, uh, the Pallak, Garuda vahanam, Indra vahanam, like that. So he composed uh, 10 songs. Uh, preceded by shlokams hmm. describing the vahanam and the utsavam of each day. Okay. Uh, so, which is kind of like a video recording okay. <laughs> of each day and very beautiful imagery. They, these are in Malayalam. Hmm. These are Malayalam uh, Sanskritized again. Okay. So, uh, for example, Kanakamaya Maidum Kamala Vahana Madin Mel, Kanatturu Kanti Ode Gamikinda Dari. So, the, ka, the golden Kamala Vahanam, that is one vahanam, hmm. uh, which has a lotus. And he says, Kanatturu Kanti Ode, this so handsome, mm -hmm. one person is coming. Who is this? Mm -hmm. So then the whole, it's like a dialogue between two people. Balamadhe, uh, is it Indra because he is uh, so magnificent? Right. But no, no, Indra has many eyes, so it's not Indra. Okay. Then uh, he must be Paramah Shiva then because Shiva is so handsome. No, no, but Shiva has three eyes, so he yeah. doesn't have three eyes, so it's not Shiva. Okay. Then he's. Uh, Shining so brightly, it must be Surya. 
but uh, surya will be glowing and uh, you can't approach him but this guy is very peaceful shantam yeah shantam so it's not surya then he is bedecked in so much gold and jewelry whatever he must be uh, the who's the rich guy kubera kubera, kubera. <laughs> so yeah. kubera but kubera is very ugly looking <laughs> you know he, kubera he looks very virupa so he's not so it's not so any of these ah, then it has to be patmana bhag <laughs> it's like punch okay, punch wow. time so the, the, fine niranjan aban nona hmm. so uh, then the, he he eliminates possibility finally he says it so that is one hmm. another one andolika vahane which i have, which is there in youtube i have explained an andolika vahane shlokam and the song okay uh, there patmanabha is coming in hmm. pallak vahana hmm. so the bees are honey bees are flying hmm. and the vahana is full of flowers dripping with honey oh, so wow. for the bees they are singing oh see there is this source of honey so many flowers full of honey so the bees are coming like hmm. so that is what it it means to the bees hmm. uh, while Uh, young ladies or even old ladies are watching him wow oh, he is so handsome mm-hmm. so for the ladies they are just seeing this very handsome man yeah. so that is what strikes them then all the devas are standing in heaven and they are looking down and for them he is devadi devadi the ultimate deva mm-hmm. uh, is this person yeah then for the munis for munis he is like the ultimate paramahamsa mm-hmm. so it's the same person who is coming but yeah. bees look at him like this devas look at him like that ladies look at him like this munis look at him like that and for bhakta jana for the devotees he is like an ocean of love anbin aali anbus like a tamil word anbin aali the ocean of love then it's patmana bhag you know so it's not just describing kaisa de padam or you have a lotus in your navel and nice eyes and you are brave and what but yeah, in a yeah. very different way yeah, yeah, yeah imagery because he was a great patron of dance also hmm. so all these songs are very very uh, danceable okay, okay same with his uh, shringara padams also okay his padam romantic padams also uh, typical nayika nayaka bhavam where though the composer is maharaja swaitnal who's a man he takes himself as the woman hmm. and uh, sri patmanabha or lord krishna hmm. uh, as the nayaka yeah and okay. saying oh we were intimate earlier but now you have forgotten me so what yeah. is it i feel sad and all the things he is not just singing you have forgotten me is singing to a sakhi hmm. so to a friend he is saying hey see he is not uh, looking at me hmm. and uh, there suppose there are 10 words around 8 words will be uh, complimentary words to the sakhi alivani alivani means ali is a uh, uh, black beetle so okay. her veni her hair is like black beetle shining the beetle. shining like black man moving also alivani antu cheu enna pannavali what can i do hanta it's like hanta is like ayyo hanta hanta nyani ni na ini no na enna pannavali what can i do ீபன் இங்கே வரலையே ஹசன் கம் வந்து இல்லோ ஐயோ வரலையே தட்ஸ் ஆல் இட்ஸ் அ சிம்பிள் சே பத்மநாபா இன் ஸ்டில் ஹி ஹசன் கம் வந்து so normally hindu the, 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 the night where the moon is rising hmm. so normally that's a beautiful sight hmm. but normally but now because he is not coming and i am missing him all these beautiful things which normally appear beautiful they are giving me pain and so when okay. i see them looking now he is not come so uh, like that so uh, and beautiful uh, 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 what do you call a beautiful imagination uh, very imagination. very very beautiful and you have to have that much of a woman in you hmm. to feel a uh, man loves a woman also mm. a woman loves a man also but the mm. way a woman loves uh, has something more intense or sweet or i don't know the correct word mm-hmm. so otherwise he could have written a 
love song the other way around no as mm. krishna is missing radha i can write like that okay. but okay. all the songs not only swaitrana mm. chaitra all those padam masters mm. uh, they put themselves in the position of a woman and write uh, mm. of course vachanas are different mm. akka mahadevi and all that wow that is an <laughs> yeah. another uh, area altogether uh, okay thank you thanks for that wonderful uh, insight um now uh, swati tirunal uh, had written uh, some upakhyana so yes, can uh, you uh, two please, uh, two upakhyana one about the life of ajamila mm-hmm. one about the life of kuchela mm-hmm. so kuchela upakhyanam ajamila upakhyanam okay the description of they can be danced as a dance play okay play with, with shlokams describing the thing and songs mm-hmm. so they are uh, they are also if we look at his normal composition like sara saksha paripalaya so sara saksha sarasam is a lotus akshi is a guy hmm. so lotus eyes paripalaya please look after me mahamayi santatam always yeah. look after me karunaya kindly jagadisha hmm. uh, jagadisha is like the lord of the earth and his wife sir lakshmi and bhumi hmm. so bhumi jagadisha that is also there yeah. so tipika kripaya palaya saure deva deva kalyami te hmm. charanam bhuja same they are all the one type uh, okay. language here but in these upakhyanams because he is describing things it is a different kind of language he uses okay for both uh, ajamila story and uh, kuchela story kuchela. Mm-hmm. and some of his sweetest compositions uh, it's difficult to say then i think of his navaratri kriti they are so sweet then mm-hmm. i think of his padam they are so sweet <laughs> so they are yeah. all sweet but in a different way okay. i mean halwa is different and uh, laddu is different chocolate is different ice cream is different. Correct, like correct. each one is different kind of sweetness yeah so they are all sweet but they are each one is different like that so his upakhyanams are very very nice um, i i sing one uh, from kuchel upakhyanam okay. which i have tuned myself uh, okay. so swatrnal so uh, like balamurli sir also you earlier asked balamurli sir specialty hmm. so dikshitar balamurli krishna swatrna they all use swaraksharams a lot ah okay they, they say sa ra sa so sa ri sa sa ra sa pari pal so like the lot of swaraksham just come automatically hmm. so i got the lyrics of a uh, song from kuchela pakhyana hmm. where you know kuchela story of course he goes yeah. to sri krishna yeah. and then she eats the puffed rice avel and yeah. then his house gets transformed into a palace hmm. and his wife becomes uh, very rich and whatever right but he doesn't know that has happened so then hmm. kuchela is coming back home hmm. and where his house used to be he sees this big a palace yeah, yeah. and he sees these beautiful women dressed very nicely and whatever yeah so then he is stunned seeing that he does where is my house what is <laughs> happening so at that time uh, the wife sees him hmm. coming from there and she knows that kuchela went to see krishna and then all these things happened so hmm. she is like so happy with her husband okay <laughs> that he managed the miracle okay, okay. so uh, from far away she sees him coming and mentally she does namaskaram to him okay uh, and uh, she i sir filling with tears yeah, and yeah. she is singing and dancing with uh, her uh, female friends hmm. and instruments and what is this scene right so okay. sadhu tada nija bhamini sapadita darsh nimohini vadya geeta pari vanita nikarai paricharito di nilasini sadhu tada nijabhamini sapadit darshavimogini vadyakita padi vanita nikarai paricharito divilasini sadhu tada nija bhamini karuna nirikshan sambhramagal duru bashpa mukhim mrudu hasini sakala bharan vibhushan deha divya tarambarshalini sadhu tada manasa she mentally she is doing uh, pada namana hmm, hmm. now physically he is there only he is not reached yeah. so man but ma ni sa swaram oh wow. manasa nija pada namanam <laughs> sahasa rachayanti 
गजगामी पंकजनाभ कृपामृत वर्षा अमर वूमिव कुछ ये लो बाकी है ना इन बकुला भरना ओके आगे सो सेम बट आज हम लोग बाकी है ना वर्ल्ड सो ओके आगे वेरी स्पेशल सॉंग्स हैं आते हैं एंड वंडरफुल लिरिक्स एंड आल्सो इफ वी नो द मीनिंग एंड व्हेन वी हियर इट वी कैन रियली एन्जॉय इट लॉट एब्सोल्युटली फॉर दैट नॉट ओनली फॉर स्वाइटर ना फॉर � म्यूजिक एंड सी दे सरस्वती आस्थानम दे संगीतम अपनी साहित्य म्यूजिक एंड लिरिक्स वी से इन इंग्लिश आल्सो सो म्यूजिक एंड लिरिक्स हैं नॉट फिफ्टी फिफ्टी बोथ आर हंड्रेड हंड्रेड सो बोथ आर कंप्लीट सो वी डोंट पे अटेंशन टू लिरिक्स इट्स इनजस्टिस एंड इट्स अ बिग लॉस टू अस एंड टू द लिसनर्स � I have a lot more questions actually yeah, to ask. This became a but, uh, <laughs> long interview. <laughs> yeah, 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 it became same duration like a concert. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, sir. And uh, I mean, really, I mean, it was really wonderful to under, I mean, uh, listen to you and actually get so many uh, things. Thank uh, you. It's my I have I have listened to many of your interviews, but there were a lot of uh, new things to uh, listen to. So. Reddit goes to home. <laughs> Some yeah. new light was thrown means it's a great light means it's Kiran <laughs> because of. <laughs> Kiran only. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much for uh, thank you. the my time pleasure. and uh, my pleasure. Yeah. Thanks for this interview, thank sir. You.